Today the Atomos 4K RAW drive by Angelbird finally arrived at my place, which is an SSD drive specifically designed for recording 4K Cinema DNG RAW sequences on the notorious range of Shogun recorders. By the way, it seems to be the only supported drive for my Inferno, so I guess I didn't have much choice anyways. Inside the box, well, there's another box and the Angelbird drive comes as professionally packed as any other drive I've unpacked in my life. Um, what's worth mentioning is the all metal housing, which means bye bye flimsy plastic housings. This thing is ready to go into the media tray of my Shogun Inferno. The latest version of the Shogun operating system finally supports Cinema DNG as recording format up to 30 FPS with RAW enabled cameras like my Sony FS5 with RAW license. To my surprise, recording 2K high frame rate continuous Cinema DNG RAW at 100 frames per second also worked without any problem. Now let's just take a quick look at what we'll have to deal with in the end. Inside the take folder, there's an audio folder with a multi-channel WAV file that contains the uh, camera audio and whatever you plugged into the Shogun. And then there's the image folder, which contains the individual Cinema DNG RAW stills. I'll open one of them with Adobe Photoshop just to show you how easy it is to adjust parameters like uh, white balance or tint before the debayering process. Um, Adobe Photoshop is a very high quality application to debayer, uh, but it takes quite a long time. The most uh, practical solution is probably DaVinci Resolve. Um, just a bit unhappy about the fact that my dearest editing application, my preferred editing application, Final Cut Pro, doesn't support Cinema DNG RAW the same way it supports RAT RAW. But, well, the quality itself is just amazing. The Angelbird drive is working like a charm. So, thank you very much for listening. Have a nice day. And hopefully I'll have the time to record another YouTube video soon.